Well, good afternoon and welcome to Portland today. So did you spend this rainy weekend catching up on TV? The six part documentary Wild Wild Country is one of the biggest shows on Netflix right now for good reason. It is fascinating. It looks back on one of the most unforgettable stories of Oregon, my very favorite story, the story of the Rajneesh and the town of Antelope. And they relied heavily on archive footage from the Oregon Historical Society. So Carrie Timchuk joins us now from the Oregon Historical mm -hmm. so Society. And you actually um, got to kind of meet the filmmakers before this was even one of their ideas. I mean, how did this wild, wild country kind of come to be? Well, the filmmakers also made uh, the Battered Bastards of Baseball, mm -hmm. which was another Netflix sensation about the Portland Mavericks, the and, wacky minor league baseball team. And was Kurt team. Russell in, he right, was being part Russell, of... Kurt's grandfather was the okay, owner, okay. owner I knew there Kurt was some played a role in that. So, in there. so they used a lot of the footage that we had from uh, Portland news stations, including mm -hmm. KGW, mm -hmm. in our archives about the Mavericks. So they were talking to our film preservationist, Matt Cowan. Now he asked them, what's next for you? And they said, well, we're trying to think of another idea. And he said, have you ever heard of the Rajneeshis? And uh -huh. they weren't, they were from California. They had never heard of the story. So he said, you can't believe the footage we have on this in our right. archives. So the more they got into it, the more fascinated they became yes. and Good. the rest, as, as we say, is history. Carrie, so. let's talk about the fact that they had never heard of it. So. Because I cannot imagine mm. that being the case today, but you're right. Mm. When this occurred, it was a local story. Mm. It got touched on yeah. now and then nationally, but it was not but it was, a it huge was 1981 to 84. There was no social media. Okay. There was no internet. There was no binge watching. Right. There was no n none of this, so it was both basically, basically a local story until all hell broke loose, right. until the salad bar poisoned. Okay, there was when they else. tried to, you know, kill it's, those people. There was that. Yeah. Oh, that, so, yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> But it was local until then, and then it went national. And then you, you'll see in, this, in the show some clips from the national news. Right. Most of them are from the from the local news. Mm -hmm. I, I believe you have an appearance in well, there. Well, yeah. I so. think I do. <laughs> you might not recognize me because it was before the uh, flat irons came yeah. into being. <laughs> I have enormous hey, hair there. there. It's a little so, bit short right there. Yeah. But um, yeah, I was out to Rajneesh Param a few times. Okay. And I remember we used to fly into that box canyon out there. And the right, takeoff so. is what really got my, uh, my interest. But it was a super interesting time. And I think what always caught me off guard is that these were a lot of highly educated yes. people who chose to follow like a that? man yeah. who had 90 Rolls Royces. Yeah. Not only follow them, but provide the money that allowed him to buy the 90 gave Rolls Royces. Their gave them yeah. their worldly goods. And yeah. then went to this ranch and dressed in the robes. And it's, a, it's just a fascinating story. So. It is. So when you look back on it, what do you think made the cut in this series and what didn't? Well, what's interesting is they, they really don't take a stance. You notice they, so they let everybody tell their story uh -huh. uh, from the, the believers to Ma and Nod Sheila, who has right. the most camera time probably well, now uh -huh. living, living in Europe, uh -huh. to the prosecutors. Uh, one person I wish they had, uh, they had mentioned was Norma Paulus who was Secretary of State then, yes. and really was key in the election fraud that was going on there and making, you know, putting them through the test to make sure they were doing everything by the rules. And, and Norma is, is not in there, and I, I wish they had mentioned her in there because she was a key, a key player back then. Well, so. it's hard to include oh, everything to, every, that happened yeah, exactly. with all the bizarre so. twists and turns. I want you to know they did have a gift shop at the ranch, <laughs> and I Which still have bizarre, some souvenirs the yeah. from there. This little bumper mm -hmm. sticker, I've been to the mm -hmm. ranch yeah. at Rajneesh Prom. I think we still have a mug somewhere so, in the house with Bogwan's face on and it. And I can't help but That's notice, awesome. but you're in purple and red today. I know, this yeah. is the, how that worked yeah. out. So. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Cold followers, yeah. But I mean, talk about this, because when I was watching this, and I'm wondering, you know, how did they get all this money to buy all this construction equipment? I mean, these are smart, smart yes, people. Yes, so. How did they kind of get well, they, know, they, they built a town, a, a complete this. community out well, of nothing. Well, it did nothing, have tremendous so. infrastructure. It, I, absolutely. Right? So an it was very impressive sewer when you went there. And construction. Yeah. They, there they was built irrigation for the farming, right. great vegetarian yeah. food, as well as that gift shop, yeah. I might add. What do you think it was about that lifestyle, though, that was so appealing to people? I, you know, I can't tell. I mean, just, okay. I mean, basically giving up everything to uh, go and just spend the whole day 
working as part of a community is, is yeah. what they did, or being yeah. part of a, of a community. Well, there was a lot of free love. There was, was that. Very there was that. <laughs> so, Tracy, you had to careful. have a certain so, wristband exactly. clear so, yeah, for so. that oh. participation. Yeah. And everything was went. I mean, as well as it could go for a while until, you know, it took the turn where they got into a fight with the the, the residents of Antelope, yeah. with the county, with the state over land use, over zoning, and that's when the, the poisoning started. Yeah, that's they, what so. makes this documentary exactly. so interesting is that it has all the aspects <laughs> of a great movie. It is a Only movie. Only it's so. true, true so. yeah. right? Only it's true. And I thought it was fascinating. So KGW donated to the Historical yes, Society. So. All of our a unedited big, footage. Big hats off to KGW for, I mean, that much of the footage that is in the, in yeah, the film. Yeah, I mean, we is, would not it, be able to see it. Amazing. if, if I mean, at many stations, day. and Tracy probably knows this, mm -hmm. during the height of the story, they just went there all day, of and they course. were allowed to just run the camera all day. Absolutely. Just pure unedited footage yeah. of the whole thing going on. So, yeah. No, but I would go back. We would go back and forth because I was anchoring the news right. at the time. But some of our other reporters did have extended right. stints there, and it was very open yep. until, 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 as you mentioned, things took a really negative right. turn. And then it was much more controlled with only kind of press conferences and, right. and Sheila yelling at us, yes. basically so, yes, yelling at it, us. So. Uh -huh. Yeah. So, yeah, but what a great, what a very interesting time in Oregon history, and I'm so glad that people are really Hopefully. finally Hard to believe it was getting a chance to look at the story. Some 35 years no. ago. And look at us, happened. we haven't look, changed up. You look exactly bit. the same. Oh my so. gosh, you too, Carrie. So. <laughs> <laughs> that is so great. Well, thanks so much for sharing some of that background with us. You bet. Such an interesting time. So. I've been. To the range. You've been there, yes, mm -hmm. exactly. I want to see that mug. You yeah, I'll find it, it. I'll keep looking.